Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. This week we are working on this old secretary desk. Lots of potential here and I'm probably going to keep this desk, at least for a little bit. I began by removing the hardware and cleaning it with a white lightning. For my base color, I chose this beautiful purple color Aberdeen. It's a beautiful purple color, not too dark and not too light purple, just right. I love the coverage of this color. I love coverage of Dixie Belle in general. has had a few makeovers already. It had previously been painted, then stripped and stained, and now it's getting painted again. Once the base coat was dry, it was time to start playing with more colors. I could really use a change of scenery, yeah. First off, I use Gold Digger Metallic Color along with Aberdeen. I'm still fly, I'm still fly, We will be layering colors the while paint is wet. I'm still fly, let's go. What you want to do is add another coat of Aberdeen and the, while paint is still wet, start adding gold digger. Working both colors, creating this beautiful blend. It's like a blend and layering at the same time. I did this in sections to keep the paint wet. Cheers to all the haters, cause you proved to me yeah. that rising to the top was my destiny. Yeah. And you can see whatever from behind me, but I'm still fly, I'm still fly, I know. I'm still fly, I'm still fly, let's go. It could all be worse, I could be a hater like you. Next, I use some caviar to create some depth, and I love creating depth. Just say it with your chest now, say it with your chest now. I'm young, I'm free, can't nobody take me. I added this around the corners in details. On the 
went back to my original brush and used purple to tie everything in. I'm tapping most of the time instead of brushing for this effect. It's my time to ride it. I'm young, I'm free. Can't nobody take me here and now. Then I grab more gold and did the same thing. It's my time, it's my time, it's my time to ride. Then back to purple. As you can see, it's a lot of going back and forth. You will need mm, a few brushes for this. You're going to want to use different brush for each color. I just played with all the colors until I felt happy with it. Also, you have to remember, it's going to look much different when everything dries. I repeated the same process everywhere. For the legs, I gave them a deep look in black. I basically painted them black, then blended them in the same way as before. Now for some detailed work, which I really love. I grabbed a rusty nail. This color already looks like rust, so it will be perfect. I'm using a small, very, very small detailed brush for this. I added rust around my hardware and edges. On the hardware, I'm making it look like the rust is going down. I feel like that's how it will have naturally looked. 
I also went around the details and corners doing the same thing. Work slow and add more as you go. You don't want to grab too much paint when doing this. This is just to add a little touch of rust to the piece, but not too much. Then, with another detail brush, I use my gold digger to highlight some parts of the desk. I made the hardware and some other details solid gold. beautiful. I grabbed a third small detail brush and went over the rust with some black. I used my blending brush to tie that in by tapping. decided to add a little bit more gold with the stencil. This small stencil was perfect for creating a border. It's so small you can just hold it without tape. A cave, a dream that no one could save, a shelter, a whole act. A light that died with the night You and I, we got our differences Yet I thought we were more alike than unlike Months of rain and chest pain was old and the wood was dry. I decided to use Big Mama Spada to help moisturize it. It worked great for this. decided to use a big mama bata for protection. You can always use these natural waxes to protect your pieces. 
My beautiful purple gold desk smells like oranges and I'm really looking forward to putting it in my office. And that's it! I really hope you liked this video. If you did, leave me a comment below, give me a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you next week with another video. Bye guys!